everybody. Hello. From the Disney Dream. We made it on board. Uh, we were well, kind we of. Well, we didn't tell too many people. We didn't tell too many people were coming. That's because we were. I mean, in this day and age, it's COVID's everywhere still, and it's getting crazy. So um, we got our cleared to sail, and we are ecstatic about that. So. Yes, we've been on the ship for a couple hours now. We spent an hour at the pool. We're in our room now on our veranda. Yeah. Um, interestingly, we got to the port today and things have changed. Things changed drastically. Uh, we're actually the first ship, the first sailing with Disney. At least on the dream. Yeah, on the dream. That um, basically all the social distancing, uh, we knew that masks weren't going to be required in public areas uh, for vaccinated, well, obviously for vaccinated people. Um, but everything at the, the buffet at Cabana's. Yeah, Cabana's is self serve again. again. Ice cream is self serve again. Drinks were self serve. Drinks have been self serve for a while again. Oh, um, there is no longer a limit on how many kids are in the pool. Yep. Um, there was, there's yeah. no wait here lines. There's no stand on these circles in the atrium for your little show when you get on. Yeah. We have not gone to see any characters. We know that regular character meet and greets are coming back on April 18th to the parks and the ships. But we're going to see, you know, I'm sure it's still distanced, but maybe slightly different. Um, we don't want to talk at you too long, and no. the kids are watching Mickey cartoons behind us. But we just wanted to, you know, say, hey, we're here, we're on the ship, and that things are looking different. Definitely different. Yes. Um, hopefully, whoop, I am slipped off the armrest there. Hopefully... <laughs> Things stay this way, but you know, cases of COVID are spiking again in Asia. They're spiking again in the UK, apparently. So we hope that things um, continue in a good direction. But no matter what, right now, I don't have to be anxious again. No. I'm, I've had serious anxiety about this since we had to cancel um, our February cruise in January. If you don't know, we were supposed to cruise at the beginning of February, but Bella. Uh, got a positive COVID test two weeks before we were supposed to sail, exactly two weeks before we were supposed to sail. Um, so we canceled that one and moved it, and now here we are. Um, I felt okay today, anxiety-wise, until we started to leave our hotel for the port, and then I started to freak out a little bit. And then the 25 minutes we were waiting for results in the car, I was, you know... Yeah. And the testing process was really cool. Uh, yeah, it was, actually, it looks like no one, everybody's. Uh, yeah, everybody is in in the parking lot waiting for results. I guess at least or, as of right now. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we we pulled up. You know, it, we have video, so yeah. we'll make that a separate video. This is just our. Hey, we'll we'll see you in yeah. a few days. However, you should definitely check out tomorrow's video as well. You get two videos this week. Um, yep. Tomorrow is my day checking out the extended evening hours for deluxe resort guests at Magic Kingdom mm -hmm. from when we came down in February. Yep. Oh, hey, yeah, it's April now. It is April. I can't say last month anymore. Yeah. Well. I hope uh, that you guys uh, enjoyed the video. It's very short, I know, but. Um, I think they like it that way. I think they do too. We will see you after we get off the ship on Monday. And we'll start posting videos uh, starting next week. Yep. So. All right. Bye. Bye.